Welcome back to another fishing video on Angler Call of the Wild. In this video, I catch Sidewinder, the legendary lake trout. Now, it took me about an hour, and I'll show you a little clip on a map where I caught him. But I've just been jigging with a four rot hook and a worm, and uh, I hooked him right there. I managed to uh, narrowly avoid missing him because I was about to go into the menu when I got the strike notification, but I managed to hook him and he just starts to run. Now I'm using the chief console and the mediator 66 pound braided line. Um, I don't trust my line because he's heavier than the line, so I kept my drag at around 50%. Just let him run, tire himself out. And uh, here, let me show you on the map where I, I caught him, and this is for the week of September 28, 2023. He is just right here where. Uh, you could see me on the the map there. Um, feel free to pause that and get a better look. Uh, making videos is not my strong point, but catching fish is. So let's pull him in. So we're just going to fast forward through this 16-minute uh, fight in which I pretty much just let him tire himself out. Now there does come a point where I bring him up to the surface and you'll see him flash for a second and then he does his last stand and he takes another dive. Anyway, uh, where you want to come out is, as you can see, I'm looking straight ahead. I can see the uh, the lumber mill. And so you just come out from the lumber mill. There's a little patch of uh, lily pads or flowers, whatever it is out here. And uh, I'm just kind of hanging out by that, casting north towards the lumber mill and uh, managed to hook him. So here he's coming up. Uh, I've got him tired out. I'll bring him up here to oh, maybe 20 feet. You'll see him flash in the water and then he just dives down. And I was being real cautious here. I lowered my drag down to 40 just because I didn't want him to snap the line. But we just get a, a quick little peek of him. And he's already taken off again so it, did, it didn't take long. Uh, and then he just pulls, goes back down to 100 and something feet. He's right, on, right along the bottom. And we just keep going. Now I've, I've heard people have caught him on a spoon. Um, I tried a spoon, a crankbait, tried the worm. Uh, it was the, the, the four-aught jig head with the worm that got him and I was jigging at four times speed. Uh, I've heard Sidewinder likes fast lures and so I was sure to, to give him the, the four speed to jig that in. The nice thing with the heavy jig head is see it's easy and quick to let it sink down to the bottom and then you just jig it up and just keep doing it for uh, it took me about an hour but finally when I bring him up here I thought he, I would have another fight on my hands but uh, he came willingly got him up to the boat and uh, kept a little tension on the line scared to catch and here's the prize he is an absolute monster 110 pounds just over five feet Fought him for 16 minutes and 3 seconds. Uh, wonderful, wonderful fish. That was a lot of fun. I do encourage everyone to go out and try this. I caught him at night. Uh, some people say you can only catch him in the day. For some reason, the, the moon went behind a cloud just there and and, and wrecked the rest of my, my photo session here where I'm trying to get pictures of him. Um, I had him in the light for just a second until the, the moon ducked away. But anyway... I encourage everyone to go out and get Sidewinder. You don't need the top gear, but you do need good gear in the game to get him. So good luck to everyone. May all your casts be true, and happy fishing.